It's great this morning um, in Belfast City Hall. I welcome the Cuban ambassador into the city and also representatives of the Cuban government. Um, it's great to have them in Belfast this morning and also in our wonderful City Hall. Um, we had a discussion around social rights, human rights, the role of women in politics and Cuba is actually very progressive with 53% of their assembly made up of women and that's something that we had a discussion about and trying to strive for in Belfast but indeed right across the island as well. So it's a really productive day um, and I wish them well on their two days of engagements while they're here. And, and across Belfast, as you know, we have great admiration for the Cuban people suffering under a very iniquitous blockade for many years. Uh, that rapprochement with uh, the US has, has gone backwards under the current president. So it's very important that we, we express our continuing solidarity with the, the Cuban people and, and, and send out the message also to all those people who have made their home in Belfast that uh, diversity, internationalism, international solidarity is a core part of everything that Sinn Féin believes in and the witness that the uh, Cuban ambassador is able to give here today to the suffering and the struggles and the travails of, of local people is, is crucially important. So we're going to really wish the ambassador Kedmi Lafaccia. Uh, we know he will benefit from his, his visit and I hope that there are more friendships, partnerships and alliances with the Cuban people in the time ahead. The visit of our Cuban comrades to Belfast today was very important. It was a renewal of the long-standing solidarity that Irish Republicans have had with the Cuban people. We told them today that we've drawn inspiration from their struggle from the inception of the revolution and today Sinn Féin and Irish Republicans and progressives throughout Ireland continue to draw inspiration from the efforts of the Cuban people and the Cuban revolution to develop a society that embraces all Cuban citizens and guarantees uh, equality and economic progress and social justice for people in that country. We had a very useful exchange of opinions. We shared analyses about what is happening here in Ireland and also in Cuba in the broader uh, international context. Personally it was excellent to meet uh, with our friends. Uh, I've watched the case of the Miami Five for many years and uh, the release of the Miami Five was uh, not just a victory for them but a victory for us all and I said that to Fernando uh, just before he left today. I wish them well in the rest of their trip. It's been excellent to have them here in Ireland today. I think all of us in the Sinn Féin delegation learned a lot from our experience. To finish, as we would say to our friends in, in Cuba, Chucky Arla, but hasta la victoria siempre. It's been a privilege uh, for me to be here in, uh, in Ireland, North Ireland, and uh, visit with the friends of uh, Sinn Féin. Talk to them, explain to them the, what the Cuban reality is, and uh, listening from them what their views on the situation in this country, and uh, having the opportunity to thank them for the solidarity that they show that, that they have shown through the years, first with Cuba and then with the, the, the case of the Cuban Five. While we were in prison, we received the solidarity and the support uh, of Sinn Fein and many friends throughout uh, the country and it's a, an opportunity to thank them all and, and express the gratitude of, of our families and all of, uh, of all five. And especially coming to here to this uh, Republican path and, and, and see uh, those who uh, lay here rest for being part of the, the struggle of uh, Irish people is, is just a moving moment. Um, really, and it's something that I, uh, I will always carry with me, uh, and I will always remember. And it's, uh, it's also uh, a way to strengthen my commitment to my own people uh, in, in our struggle and going through our difficulties. That there is uh, people that uh, sacrifice their lives for what they believe in. It's very moving, very touching. Um, let me take this opportunity to, in the name of the Embassy of Cuba, in the name of Cuban people, thanks again to Chin Feng for the solidarity, uh, support the campaign to free the Cuban Five. We have here one of them uh, has been welcomed in Belfast. But for all the solidarity with the Cuban people, and particularly the solidarity uh, to put an end to the economic blockade against 
the Cuban people imposed by practically 60 years by American government. Thanks very much. Sinn Féin, Goananis Carta Agus Eintas Naharan, Equality, Rights and Irish Unity.